제82회 취미가 뭐예요? Hello everyone and welcome to Let's Be Korean. I'm your host Lisa Kelly and today we're going to be talking about our hobbies. What do you like to do? What do you do in your free time? What's your hobby? And of course, answering that question uh, makes for good small talk and conversation. What do you like to do? I like uh, scuba diving as a matter of fact. Mm -hmm. Hello, I'm Blake and uh, I really like uh, playing backup tambourine for my brother's band and lately I've been picking up a little golf. All right, Tim Burr, you can hit that tree, huh? <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, me and Young will try our best to help you along. Take a look at our lesson. 네, 안녕하세요. 아리랑 TV 시청자 여러분 만나서 반갑습니다. 태원입니다. 너 하나 없을 뿐인데 가질 쉽게 잃고 싶은데 머리띠가 어울려. 그게 안 돼. All right, let's talk about what you like to do. You know, when you are just having a little chit chat with someone or easy conversation, this is one way to kind of break the ice, right? Mm. Hey, so what is your hobby? What do you like to do? What do you do in your spare time? Lisa Shinan Chimi ga boyo. The important word here is chimi. Chimi is hobby. Say that for me. Chimi. 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 Okay, so you can ask, what's your hobby? Chimi ga boyo. What is what, right? So boyo, you're asking the question, what is your hobby? Chimi ga boyo. Chimi ga boyo. Chimi ga boyo. And of course, here we're asking Lisa, but you can just address any of your friends. I'll pick a friend and ask them, hey, uh, oh, I'll talk to my friend Brad. Brad, Chimiga Boel? You ask a friend. Uh, how about Rufus? Rufus, Chimiga Boel? And the response was, Tonin, Tennis, Chinin, Go, Chua, Hail. I like. Playing tennis. Now, tennis phonetically in Korean is tennis. 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 Okay. Tennis. I right. Can do that. And the verb to play tennis in Korea is literally to hit the ball. Okay. Chida is to ow, hit. Okay. And so we're hitting the ball. Tennis. Chinungo. Tennis. Chinungo. Tennis. Chinungo. All right, tennis, tennis, tennis. Right, hitting the ball around is, I think, how you you can literally think of it. I like hitting the ball around. Tennis, chinungo, and then we have to say we like it, don't we? Chuwayo is we like it, we like it, and then we say chuwaheo. We like to do, okay? We like to hit the ball around or hit the tennis ball around. Tennis, chinungo, chuwaheo. Tennis, chinungo. Right. Tennis What do you like to do? I like to, I like to golf. Okay. 저는 테니스 치는 거 좋아해요. 테니스 치는 거 좋아해요. Let's explore this just a bit further. Okay. Um, tennis 치다. Right. That is the verb. 치다 is the verb for hitting tennis, just like Lisa said. Tennis chida. Well, we took out the ta and then put a nun at the end, and that sort of puts it into a noun form, right? So the nun and the ka makes it into a noun form. Tennis chinen go chuaheo. I like hitting tennis. It's basically like putting an ing, hitting mm -hmm. tennis, ing at the end, and accentuating the verb, right? right? So you could uh, mm. put it together with, uh, with another verb, right? At mm -hmm. the end. I know you like uh, taking pictures. Can you do one with taking pictures? There you go. Yeah. You just uh, read my mind, <laughs> right? Uh, this is a little girl taking a picture of, what is that, a squirrel? What is I, that? I guess so. It looks like she's got like a helmet on her head, Maybe though. It doesn't look like she's taking a picture. <laughs> okay, either way, she has a, um, a, 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 a camera, right? A camera. Now, to take a photograph or a picture, a photograph or a picture is hajin, right? Mm -hmm. To take a photograph is to jikta, jikta, jikta. And using that blank nun and then the call at the end of a uh, verb, uh, you take out the ta and then jik nun ko, right? So mm -hmm. hajin jik nun go. If you like taking photographs, then you would say, 저는 사진 찍는 거 좋아해요. 
사진 찍는 거 좋아해요. 사진 찍는 거 좋아해요. Now this is um, something that Blake said he likes to do, right? Oh, I love to ski. Ski. Yeah. ski. What is this guy doing? He is ski tada. He is riding skis. Mm -hmm. He's ski tada, right? And tada is the verb there. Take out the ta and then put that, put the nun and then the ko at the end of that. Then you got ski tanen go. Blake, ski tanen go joaheyo. Ski tanen go joaheyo. Hamzashio! Young? Young, is that you? Hey, Lisa, what's up? What are you doing in this getup? I mean, you're wearing such a nice suit and you got this squid on your face? This is a traditional Korean thing. Can you just take oh, that no, okay, thing let me off? take this little dry squid off. Here. Ooh. I am the Hamjinabi or the Ham Carrier. What's ham? I'm carrying this Ham over to my friend's bride to be's house. Oh, like dowry. Exactly, okay. exactly. Yeah, yeah. See, in Korea, they have this whole thing called ham, which is a collection of little gifts, um, such as rings, jewelry, bags, makeup, and it's given to the bride to be before the marriage, before the wedding, um, as a as a symbol of saying thanks, I guess, right? I see. And okay. there's even a uh, nice little paper, a honsaji, and it's a letter basically giving the bride and the groom permission to get married, included in this ham here. No, you don't eat that. Oh, I have to okay. wear sorry, that. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay. Blake, this test is going to be a bit different. You're going to get missions, and uh, basically, what you're trying to do is you're trying to win the heart of Lisa. Mission number one, mm -hmm. you want to find out what her hobby is. What is her hobby? Ask her in Korean. Lisa Shinun, Chimiga, Bueyo. Tadesa, you did great. I like watching movies and I like reading books. The third and final mission, Lisa's gonna ask you a question in Korean and you're going to answer in Korean. Blake 씨는 취미가 뭐예요? 저는 테니스 치는 거 좋아해요. Lisa, now remember, chimi is hobby, so you're asking, what is your hobby? Boeo? You can just ask boeo, and that means, what is that? Here, if you add the word chimi, hey, what's your hobby? Chimi ga boeo? The answer, 저는 테니스 치는 거 좋아해요. I like playing tennis. Note, if you just said 저는 tennis 좋아해요, that means I like tennis. But if you said 저는 tennis 치는 거 좋아해요, adding the verb, then it means I like playing tennis or hitting the ball around. Note the difference in meaning. So practice the nun call form and that adds a little bit more meaning, action to your sentence. Thank you so much for joining us on LSK and we'll be back next time with more wonderful expressions. Goodbye. Goodbye. 안녕히 계세요.